worst NHL GM's Chuck Fletcher. After a less than impressive stint with the Minnesota Wild, Chuck Fletcher was named the new GM of the Philadelphia Flyers. Since taking over as GM in December of 2018, the Philadelphia Flyers have only gotten worse and don't seem to be getting better anytime soon. Here are the worst moves made by Chuck Fletcher as GM of the Philadelphia Flyers. His worst trades were trading Claude Giroux, Connor Bunneman, German Rupsov, and a 5th round pick in 2024 to the Florida Panthers for Owen Tippett, a 1st round pick in 2024, and a 3rd round pick in 2023. Acquiring Ryan Ellis from the Nashville Predators for Phil Myers and Nolan Patrick. Acquiring Rasmus Ristolainen from the Buffalo Sabres for Robert Haig, a 1st round pick in 2021, and a 2nd round pick in 2023. Trading Shane Gossespierre, a second round pick in 2022 and a seventh round pick in 2022 to the Arizona Coyotes for nothing. Acquiring Tony D'Angelo from the Carolina Hurricanes for a fourth round pick in 2022, a third round pick in 2023, and a second round pick in 2024. Trading Ryan Hartman to the Dallas Stars for Tyler Pitlick. Acquiring Cam Talbot from the Edmonton Oilers for Anthony Stolarz. And acquiring Justin Braun from the San Jose Sharks for a second round pick in 2019 and a third round pick in 2020. Undoing Worst Trades Philadelphia Flyers trade Claude Giroux at the 2021 draft instead of at the 2022 trade deadline. They don't acquire Ryan Ellis, Rasmus Ristolainen, or Tony D'Angelo. The Flyers keep Shane Gossespear and Ryan Hartman, and they don't acquire Justin Braun or Cam Talbot. Here are some of his draft mistakes. In the 2019 draft, they should not have drafted Cam York, 14th overall, Ronnie Aktard, 73rd overall, Mason Millman, 103rd overall, Igor Serdyuk, 165th overall, and Bryce Brodzinski, 196th overall. At the 2019 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers trade picks 72, 103, and 165 to the Vegas Golden Knights for pick 79 and a third round pick in 2020. In the 2019 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should have drafted Cole Caulfield, 14th overall, Drew Hellison, 41st overall, Pavel Dorofiev, 79th overall, and Dustin Wolf, 196th overall. In the 2020 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should not have drafted Ty Forster, 23rd overall, Zaid Wisdom, 94th overall, and Elliot Disnoyers, 135th overall. At the 2020 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers trade picks 23, 85, 91, and 135 to the Montreal Canadiens for pick 16. In the 2020 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should have drafted Caden Gooley, 16th overall, and Dylan Garand, 94th overall. In the 2021 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should not have drafted Samu Tumala, 46th overall, Alexei Kolozov, 78th overall, Brian Sananti, 110th overall, Ty Merhiesen, 159th overall, Francesco R. Curry, 175th overall, and Owen McLaughlin, 206th overall. At the 2021 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers trade picks 14, 78, 110, and a second round pick in 2023 to the Ottawa Senators for picks 10 and 74. They also trade picks 159 and 179 to the Detroit Red Wings for picks 134 and a 6th round pick in 2023. In the 2021 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should have drafted Cole Sillinger 10th overall, Logan Stankoven 46th overall, Ryder Korksak 74th overall, Liam Dower Nilsson 134th overall, Matvey Petrov 179th overall, and Ty Gallagher 206th overall. In the 2022 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should not have drafted Cutter Galthier, 5th overall, Alex Bump, 133rd overall, Hunter McDonald, 165th overall, and Santeri Sulko, 197th overall. In the 2022 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers should have drafted David Juracek, 5th overall, Simon Forsmark, 101st overall, David Spotchek, 133rd overall, Josh Philman, 165th overall, and Alexander Pelevin, 197th overall. His worst signings are signing Sean Couturier to an 8-year deal worth $7.75 million per season, and Kevin Hayes to a 7-year deal worth $7.14 million per season, as well as Rasmus Ristolainen to a 5-year deal worth $5.1 million per season, Tony D'Angelo to a 2-year deal worth $5 million per season, and Nick Delaurier to a 4-year deal worth $1.75 million per season. Philadelphia Flyers don't sign any of the above-mentioned players. At the 2021 draft, the Philadelphia Flyers make a few trades. Philadelphia Flyers trade Claude Giroux to the Florida Panthers for Owen Tippett, Frank Vitrano, Grigory Denisenko, and a first-round pick in 2024. Sean Couturier is traded to the Montreal Canadiens for Phil Deneau, Tyler Toffoli, Arturi Lekkonen, and a first-round pick in 2022. They also trade Jacob Voracek and Phil Myers to the Arizona Coyotes for Phil Kessel and Elia Labushkin. At the 2022 trade deadline, a few trades are made. 
Philadelphia Flyers trade Phil Kessel and Arturi Lekkonen to the Colorado Avalanche for Andre Burakovsky in a 2024 first round pick. Tyler Toffoli is traded to the Calgary Flames for Adam Rizuka, Emil Heineman, a first round pick in 2022 and a fifth round pick in 2023. Frank Vitrano and Ilya Labushkin are traded to the Dallas Stars for Riley Tufte and a second round pick in 2023. If Dallas makes the playoffs, the Flyers receives Dallas's 2024 second round pick. The Flyers also trade Justin Braun and Derek Brassard to the New York Rangers for a third round pick in 2023 and a fourth round pick in 2024. The additional draft picks were used to select Shane Wright and Brad Lambert. Before the 2022-23 season, two trades are made. The Philadelphia Flyers trade Travis Konechny, Travis Sanheim, and Morgan Frost to the Anaheim Ducks for Maxime Comtois, Isaac Lindstrom, Simon Benoit, a second round pick in 2023, and a second round pick in 2024. Andre Burakovsky is traded to the Seattle Kraken for a third round pick in 2023 and a fifth round pick in 2024. Philadelphia Flyers signed the following players in free agency. John Klingberg to a one-year deal worth $7 million, Johan Larson to a one-year deal worth $1.5 million, and Troy Stetcher to a one-year deal worth $1.25 million. By the 2022-23 season, the Philadelphia Flyers are a rebuilding team, but at least they are headed in the right direction. The first line is Ryan Hartman centering Joel Farabee and Cole Caulfield. The second line is Cole Sillinger centering Isaac Lundstrom and Maxime Comtois. The third line is Scott Lachlan centering JVR and Owen Tippett. The fourth line is Johan Larson centering Grigory Denisenko and Zach McEwen. The first D pair is Ivan Provorov and John Klingberg. The second D pair is Shane Gossespierre and Ilya Labushkin. Third D pair is Simon Benoit and Troy Stetcher. Goalies are Carter Hart and Anthony Stolarz. Top prospects, forwards, Shane Wright, Brad Lambert, Logan Stankoven, Pavel Dorefiev, Wade Allison, Bobby Brink, Ryder Korksak, Noah Cates, David Juracek, Hayden Gooley, Drew Hellison, Emil Andre, Simon Forsmark, David Spotcheck. Goalies, Dustin Wolf, Dylan Garand. If Chuck Fletcher had decided to rebuild in 2021, it would have been better for the team in the long run. 